Okay, here we go. We are live. We'll see if uh, Streamlabs decides to do what it did on Monday. Hey, Sojan. <clears throat> if it does, I already have OBS installed and ready to go as a backup, just in case. Plus, I reinstalled um, Streamlabs just to see if that fixed anything. So, hopefully, sound is good. All right. Ugh. So, Dr. Irrefutable, um, I was going to glue some things on here. Yeah, and I'm going to keep looking over here to see if uh, my stuff is frozen. And I know you guys will uh, chime in as soon as that, uh, anything does go awry. Um, I was going to glue on a few things here, but I figured if I'm going to put on the magnets, I'm going to wait for that. So, with that, I'm going to probably call this done after I do a sepia wash on some of this stuff here. Unless there's anything else you want done on this part of the gun, Dr. Irrefutable. So, Wallace, you're thinking about that. <laughs> Write that down, and then we'll uh, go about doing our business here. And then I was going to either work on this ammo tin tonight, or on the big uh, choppa arm. Dr. Irrefutable, you tell me what you want first. Hey, man on fire. Could you paint the body of the breach area? Sweet. Okay. Um. Long day. Uh, would like this or Or what else, Dr. Irrefutable? Okay, let's kind of adjust. Sorry, guys. There we go. That's a little bit better. Oh, like right here? On this one or on this? On both. Okay. What color would you like that? <laughs> yeah, for talking like an orc. Yeah. Um. Hello there. Hey, Ty. All right, just black. Gotcha. Do you want it to have hints of metallic? Well, okay. You know what? Just going to go painting it black. I'm not going to overthink this. And uh, then we'll just take it from there. <clears throat> yeah, right now, my voice would just be hamburger if I talked like an orc for way too long. Okay, first of all, though, uh, hints of metallic would be good. Okay, so I might dry brush some metallic over. Do you want a shiny black? Like a... Uh, <laughs> no, because that would go against uh, uh, Twitch's nudity clause, even though I'm a dude, and uh, contain your thirst, okay? Go get take a hydration pack. All right, we'll go with matte black. Or, 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 actually, all right. <clears throat> uh, hold on. Or would you like a... No, this is dragon black. I have a coal black, which it kind of has a little bluish tinge to it. Would you want that, like just a flat black, or a black with bluish tinge to it? Uh... 
All right, you got it. Use Debos. Hey, Muse, how are ya? And as you can see, so far, so good. Okay, so you want all of this, all of this, and then all of this stuff here black, correct? Thank you for doing a shout out. Yeah, so far so good. And, uh, yeah. <coughs> oh, yeah. So, Jan, you back from your training then? Did you get uh, suitably drunk on your company's dollar, too? I sure hope you did. Yeah, it is Hwag Wednesday. Hey, you, Don. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's Taco Tuesday, not Taco Thursday. It's, it's Burrito Thursday. I don't know. <laughs> True enough. Okay, and this bit looks like metallic anyway, so I might leave that as uh, just metal, Dr. Irrefutable, unless you say otherwise. No, um, enchiladas is Fridays at the GI Forum. Hey, Crip Monkey. Ugh. As you can see, things are working well enough right now. No, I did not lose internet. It was, uh, Streamlabs just decided to go kaput for some reason. So, uh, yeah, that's what happened with my stream on Monday. And, um, yeah, tried to get it back a few times, didn't work. And so we hit about, like, it was like the 40-minute mark. So I just went, you know what, we're going to call it a night. Fought with uh, Streamlabs for a little bit longer. So right now it's working. Yeah. No, I would admit if the internet went down again, because I went a whole weekend without it last weekend, or the weekend before that. So, um, yeah, like, stream was going great and everything, then all of a sudden OBS just kind of 
locked up and then I tried to get back and I'd go for a little bit and Streamlabs would lock up again. So I went as far as to even do a uh, just reinstalled OB, uh, Streamlabs over the directory again just to see if it fixed anything that might have gotten somehow corrupted or just uh, donked up somehow. So, um, yeah. But I do have OBS installed in, like, bare bones, where it's basically me, you know, the two cameras. None of the um, rewards would show up or sounds would show up on my end. But uh, I have it up and ready to go just in case this does this again. So I have a backup plan. So if I lose it, and if I try again, and it it does the same thing, just switching to OBS, and leaving Streamlabs behind. Because I made no changes to the program prior, and yeah, there was no changes to my computer, like I hadn't reinstalled anything, or anything like that. So... Okay, so I'm going to start painting some of this stuff black here, Dr. Irrefutable. And if I'm painting something you don't want black, just speak up quick. Pretty much want the whole thing black. Okay. So about up to here, Dr. Irrefutable with black. Okay. Fair enough, yep. Yeah, and for anybody who's ever considered trying to have somebody do a commission piece for them, most of us artists, and I, I'm pretty sure, um, that sound's going off on random, no, A Night Whisper uh, just did the Star Wars raid sound. But I know um, both Dawn and Muse will attest to this. Tell us what you want. Tell us what... Uh, uh, what you want for colors, tell us what you, uh, you know, don't hesitate to ask, tell us, we'll make it work, and, like, uh, just now, too, um, yeah, if you want it black, you tell me you want it black, I'll make it black, I'll make a few suggestions for other types of black, like I did with the coal black, but if you ultimately say I want it matte black, look, yeah, so Jan. Yes, yeah, like reference photos, um, things like that, like complete backstories, that way we could help collaborate with you. Yeah, it makes life so easy, you know, they say, make it look close to this picture, it's perfect. Well, yeah, almost sounds like I, you know... Red door, want to paint it black. No colors anymore. I want it to be black. <laughs> and by the way, if people haven't seen The Mandalorian yet today, 
excellent episode. I liked it. A little bit side questy, but the cameos. Oh my god, the cameos in uh, this week's episode. Yeah, and this is your model, so you tell me. Just watch the way... Oh, the new Avatar movie? How was that? And yeah, so Jan, between you and a, um, like a few other friends um, from another D&D &D group, uh, yeah, I really want to see the new D&D &D movie. Like, we saw John Wick 4 last weekend on Saturday when we didn't have any kids. And that was good. Really enjoyed it. But yeah, can't wait to see the D&D uh, &D movie. Koro was really happy with the D&D &D movie. Yeah, Sojan said it was exactly something that uh, one of our groups would do. Which, yes, from the basic premise, from what I've seen, yeah. Group F, F's up. Now the groups have to un-F their F up. Like, oh yeah, that's, that's one of our groups. Actually, that's most of the groups I've been in. Just wait a minute. We helped the bad guy? I'm just going to paint the inside here black just so, you know, people peek in. <coughs> it was a fresh batch of players playing through a crazy one shot. Heard good things about it, but we haven't ventured back to the theaters yet. So expensive now, and they're charging more for the good seats versus front row back. Yeah, they should be the same. Pr well, yeah, depending on where you're at and what theaters you're going to, all the seats should be the same damn price. So yeah, that's kind of shifty as hell. Jeez. Yeah, you think they wouldn't gouge so that way people would come back. Because, yeah, here, I mean, at least in the States here, like, they're just like, hey, whatever, you know, get back here, you know. Well, 
You know, I should have thinned this a little bit, but hey, it's orcs. Paint's gonna be weird. Right, Muse? Most theaters here are cheaper on Tuesdays since that's the slowest day. Yeah, it's either Tuesdays or Thursdays are like five bucks a seat at a lot of theaters. All right, that takes a lot of pressure off. Not expecting a perfect paint job, I'm just expecting an orc paint job. I want this little bit here, all black. Like this handle of doom or whatever. All right. How's that, is that better? Or do you see any bits, like, do you want this top bit here black as well? Okay, you know what? I'm going to let all that dry. All right, sweet, yeah, and again, as a commission painter, all you gotta do is tell me just what the heck you want. All right, uh, for this ammo crate here, do you want it the same red as this, or would you want it a different color? And on top of that, would you want it a metallic color or a uh, flat color like the black? Match the other ammo can? All right. So what I am going to do, though, is I am going to hit it because this is just the primer stuff. And we all saw how it kind of uh, was kind of hydrophobic there. Got a paint to make them naughty bit. All right, I'll do. I'll give you the confused dog look here, Ty, for just a second. Uh, I'm gonna paint all of this with uh, some bolt gun, so that way the paint sticks to it. Okay. 
Like, right today, I just feel just tired enough right now that I'll keep up with most jokes. But some will just kind of not fall dead, but I'm just not going to probably get it. Which actually, I do have some caffeine. Hold on. Nothing flies over your head, Don. Your reflexes are too fast. You'd catch it. Well, I'm glad you still like the heat effect on the gun. Hell, I like the heat effect of the gun. I'm glad it turned out as good as it did. Uh, don't touch it, don't touch it, don't touch it. Aw, oh, she touched it. There we go. Okay, gonna let that dry just a little bit. And actually, I was thinking there's a lot of blank space here. I could, uh, just, like, daka daka daka, or something like that, or some other fun, orky freehand. Uh, no, I'm actually just straight up painting lead belcher on it. Uh, or bolt gun metal, lead belcher, knife, sword, father, rabbi, whatever. Um... No, I'm putting it on there because otherwise, so you kind of see here what this did. So I had just the, uh, <laughs> daka, daka, daka would be amazing. All right. But you see kind of how it peeled, like it was drawn away from here. This was just the, uh, lead belcher, uh, rattle can. And for some reason, with some of the contrast paints, it's just a little hydrophobic or whatever. So actually, I'll try to reapply that. Damn it. Ugh. Right, 
so yeah, because I need to kind of touch up some of this, so that way it... Yeah, see, watch how it just kind of beads away from it for some reason. Now, granted, some of this isn't going to be seen, but I still know it's there. So I'm going to do my best to make sure I know it's not there. So you know it's not there. Well, hey, cutie patootie. Long time no see. Yeah, I saw what that you're uh, streaming. What are you streaming Minecraft now too, or are you also still painting minis? Okay. Most of this seems dry enough, so what? my painting again a few weeks ago haven't done the gaming thing for some weird place yeah that's fine as long as you're here now feeling better just glad to see you back Okay, definitely need to let that dry. I think that'll look pretty good once it's all done.
for... Oh, Sisu? No, I did not. That one didn't play at the theater we went to. Um, I just happened to see a little bit of a trailer for it today, though I need to go back and actually watch it. Alright, have fun making the sliders, man. They sound delicious. Okay. Now, while that's drying, Dr. Irrefutable on uh, any of this, is there any specific color that you want again? Like, would you want, like, part of this, like, the casing here to be red or blue or, like, red here? <laughs> Orange. Oh, so for Cutie Patootie, the answer is always orange. For Muse, it's always purple. And then what color would you want this uh, fuel barrel? So all of this and this. You want that red, correct? Now, do you want it red like this? Okay, okay. All right, and would you want it more of a flat like I did for this, or where the metallics kind of show through a little bit? Hey, Ramshackle, uh, Ramshackle Savage. Wow, I, I don't know why I was stumbling over that. How are ya? Okay, so yes to what? Yes to where it's like this. Maybe where the metallic shows through a little more. Okay. Well, that's tough to hear, Ramshackle. All right, so what I'm going to do again on this, since uh, this is just the lead belcher base, uh, base spray paint, uh, I'm going to go ahead and hit it up again because we saw how good this worked on that. Paint sticks to it a lot better. Um, okay, or would you actually want me to use like a red metallic paint? Because I got a few options. So, I got some uh, red metallic would be cool. Okay, so I have just gemstone from Army Painter. Uh, this is a little bit more of like an orangish metallic, but it's called Life on Mars by Turbo Dork. Or I have Spicy Meatball, which wherever my... Necron is that's what color he is or I have uh, red rum so then order some custom minis pat out my army box of bulldogs from more gaming Atlantic bad because my dad was in an auto accident Yeah, the names of the Turbo Dork paints are just amazing. So here's... Uh, I don't know if that helps at all. The second on the left. Okay. So gemstone then, right? 
Oh, yeah, so you... You like life on Mars, right? Cutie patootie? Tend to mix my spicy meatball with red sun scarlet. Add some Abaddon to make it a dark red metallic. All right. Yeah, of course I can paint a small area. So, all right, small area of gemstone. Yith. All righty. so it's kind of out of the way. Definitely gonna have to do like two coats of that. Yeah, that's kind of what it looks like there. Want one of those mixers because you have one. It's my favorite thing ever. Yeah, it's it's a godsend. Okay, stick with it. Or would you want me to do a black base coat underneath and then do the red gemstone? Would you like to see that? Okay. Can do. And actually, there's a Mr. Me Seek sound effect under the bits. Okay, so these will always work a little bit better with more of a glossy black. So, since I won't bu butcher it, even though Kiko isn't here, I'll use Despoiler Black. Huh. Oh, there. there it is. And actually, I'm going to use a bit of a bigger brush because I don't have to be that careful with this. I can always go back and touch things up. Right, right, right.
So far, so good, too, as far as the streaming. You know, knock on wood. <laughs> yep. Yeah, Streamlabs just goes, wait, no Sojin? It became an episode of Who Pooped the Bed from Always Sunny in Philadelphia. It was Frank. Frank pooped the bed. But poop's funny. Sure, what's something creative? Okay, I might go only back this far with the red, unless you say otherwise. Uh, yeah, um, I'm just gonna go this far with the black, and henceforth the red, unless you want the red going all the way back to here. to figure out something for this uh, fuel barrel. Some sort of blue for that fuel barrel. Alrighty then, Batman.
Which, yeah, for that I only have either Daba D or uh, Cool Ranch as far as blue metallics. But I could just mix some blue and a metallic paint. Or just paint over it with a contrast like I did on the ammo crates and whatnot. And all of this, I was just going to go, like, uh, with a brass color. Okay. Yeah, see, here's how this all turned out. Oh, yeah, see, the contrast paints on really flat surfaces are... Eh, they're okay. Just regular blue is fine. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. I could hit it again. All right. Oh, I'll just lean back for a second. Oh, yeah. Mercury switch flipped. Thank you, Don. Yeah, I added in a few of the other little rewards and whatnot. Yeah. That is so Jan's power. Man hits a certain point in the day, he leans back far enough, you've lost him, he's out, he's gone. Blood Red Sandman. Whoog! Okay, oh. I think this black. Oh, wait. Has been missed in a few areas. Yeah, uh, sorry. And welcome to the channel, Blood Red Sandman. Uh, if you like what I'm doing here, like some of the other stuff I'm doing, feel free to give me a uh, follow and or subscribe if you so feel generous enough to do so. But yeah, um, yeah, right now I'm... Uh, <laughs> oh boy, 
Does that mean I have to go for 15 minutes? <laughs> all right, all right. I guess we're going for fifteen more minutes because of this mucking about. <sighs> well, looks like we's gonna get to the gemstone painting now. Thought we was going to get to that next week, but now we's getting to it this week. And luckily there's a 20 minute cool down on, on to talk like an orc. So nobody else can make me go even longer. Alright, that's good. That's real, that's real good. Alright, here we go. With the red gemstone painting over the black base. <coughs> yeah, boy, thank you. Not, not only is an oak, it's an oak stomper. So, see, you're gonna have to tell me what you think of this, Docker Irrefutable. I think this makes your gubbins look that much more darker. Way more flashy. And I will hit it with a second paint coat of paint. Yes. Yes, paint coat of paint. Yep, that's a thing. There's no way you can argue with me because I'm so logical. Then I got Dr. Irrefutable on my side. And his name means he, you, you can't re, you can't irrefute. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Yeah, see, see, smart orc. You didn't know you was dealing with a smart orc, did you? Alright, don't muck about with it. Gareth, just let it. Let it dry, go back, put on the second coat. Got three of them. Only one of which is painted. I'll get to the others eventually. Alright. And then, and then Dr. Irrefutable, the git that he is, I mean the nice guy that he is, he's making me paint most of the stomper yellow. I'll show you that here in a little bit. Between him and Sojan, I'm going to be a master of painting yellow. The gits. He's making me better, and I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. <laughs> yeah, see, see, look at him there. Look at him there. Be no smug saying, You're welcome. Oh, you're welcome, Gareth. Oh, he's making you a better painter. You're welcome. <laughs> Not while Dawn's just. In the corner, just yucking it up like a, like a grot drunk on squeaks milk. Yeah, squeaks have milk. <laughs> Surprise you didn't know that, but you don't know that because you've not a smart oak. 
You've been all music like. <laughs> Squig's got milk if you know where to look for it. <laughs> and you think I'm just making this up? Yeah, squeaks milk, see? See, now, now she's done thinking like an oak, she's figured out where to find the squeaks milk. is gonna get a bit messy back here. Just gonna do me best. I mean an oak always is best. Right blood red sand man, oaks is always the best. See bringing in the new people into the conversation. The way that he's got to keep chatting. We's gonna trap him here. Oh, she's the best. <laughs> Why, thank you for the follow, Blood Red Sandman. Always appreciates it. May the blessings of Gork and Mork be upon you. May you ever be brutally cunning and cunningly brutal. Why, thank you, Kitty Patooty. That's one saying your name like an orc. Green is good, green means go, and green is the best. That's why the orcs is green. You see this chopper here, it's gonna be the fastest chopper ever. It's gonna chop so fast them titans and Nords ain't even gonna know what hit them. <laughs> How many different virgins? <laughs> or versions, eh? Oi. Well, see, that's what the blue here is for. It's good luck juice for the chopper. See? See? That's why Dr. Irrefutable went with blue for the tanks. That's why it's luck juice. Oh, oh. <laughs> that's what we should put on the tank. Just for the luck juice. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's no purple yet on it, but, you know, it, you know, we got the rest of this to put some purple on it somewhere. <laughs> We could put purple on the feet, that way his footsteps is quiet. <laughs> I 
This is what these weapons go to. This is an oak stomper. Basically an oak version of a titan. There it goes. Stomp, 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 stomp. Just like that. Then it's got all sorts of extra daka. Oh yeah, that's right. These don't move. Meh, yeah, we'll fix it. Then we's gonna do some other fiddly bits here and here and there and everywhere. See, now he's doing a second coat on here. <laughs> An oak saw Titan and asked, asked himself, how can this be more oaky? And that's how this stomper was made. In the divine likeness of Gork and Moke. No, why thank you, Dr. Irrefutable. Ooh, 500 bitty bits. Ooh, cleaned out the jar almost. Sorry, Don, you missed the bomb. Adding just a little bit of water this time. Then a cut of metallic paints just to thin it down so it fits in the other bits and bobs of the gubbins. Yeah, boy, this is the second time today I'm going to have a conversation about wow, isn't it? Uh, the glory days, eh, hey, Sojan? Back playing Rafa the Lich King for the Horde too. The bestest, the bestest, biggest, most crumpinest group of gits out there.
played all or through closed beta, but then when WoW went live, all our friends went to play with the line. So, you proceeded to crump every single last one of them with your horde friends, right? Right. New cooler old friends. <coughs> okay. My voice feels a little bit like hamburger after that. See? That's why I don't want to have too many of that. While it's fun. Yeah, work time up. Time for a nap. But hey, I at least honored it, so... Uh... Yeah, what do you think of this so far? Dr. Refutable? It's definitely orky looking, like I got like a little bit of like... Something going on there. Definitely an orky red paint job. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor Refutable. <laughs> He's like Tron. He fights for the users. Doctor Refutable fights for the streamer. <laughs> Which, yeah, I watched uh, Tron Legacy recently, so that's why I kind of got that in my head. All right. Yeah, I think a second coat on this... Help this out quite a bit too. <sighs> so, shall we just raid or shall we just call it a night, guys? <sighs> I should probably lean a li little bit more towards uh, raid and dash. There we go. Alrighty. Anybody got any suggestions? Kaylee's always fun. All right, let's look. Looking under Warhammer. How about we give, uh, I would say either Unlikely Gamer Lass, or, uh, the patch has been on a while. Yeah, what do you think, guys? Unlikely gamer, lass? Give, I assume, her a raid. Yeah, I like it, too. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> All right, everybody. Um, yeah, uh, thanks for swinging by tonight. Thank you, uh, Muse, for the raid. Um, hope everyone enjoyed it. I'm glad that uh, Streamlabs did not uh, crap the bed again. Um, 
yeah, always fun to paint. And hey, thank you for giving me straight answers too, Dr. Irrefutable. So, um, without any other further ado, I will say good night, sleep tight. Most likely I'll kill you in the morning. And, uh, yeah, just remember to keep on painting.